The sun always emits energy, and a lot more energy than we possibly can use. The only problem is how much of that energy do we pick up now and with the to today's technology. <laughs> the silicon collectors of solar power that we have today use only or capture only 10 to 20 percent of uh, the solar energy. And to me, this is not enough at all. This is not an engineering solution. It's, when you tell me you're getting only 15 percent of something, I say that's not a good one. If you tell me 85 percent, maybe. So there is, there is room to, to do a lot of research in the capturing of solar energy to use it for our energy needs. I am a uh, desert geologist and I travel a great deal into the deserts of the world and the deserts of the world are in a band where we have very, f very few clouds, clouds per year and the sun is very hot and it actually uh, affects everything on the ground and, and for this reason there is no vegetation what, whatsoever and whatnot. But because of our energy use in the things that we have been getting used to, everybody in the world has been doing exactly the same. And nobody in these regions where the sun is, shines more than 300 days a, a, a year have ever thought about using solar energy instead of the way they use solar energy, the, the energy the way we use it here. So it must be uh, some way of having at least one-fourth of the area of the world using energy other than the energy that we use today, utilizing the local solar energy resources. 